there's no long play tournaments on so only five minute and three minute blitzy type stuff so do we go for a 15 10 or do we go for a 10 minute game let's see if we go for a go for a 10 minute game first see how that transpires so we'll play four games as usual it's two weeks left to the tournament so it's getting a bit tight close to the wire we'll have to start doing some um, pattern recognition training um, for the next week so this it won't be the last one but i think we need to focus more on just a little bit of pattern work it does help so we're going to go in i think are we yes are we ready let's just press play we haven't had a warm-up so really i'm just going in cold here and i should have warmed up but uh, my brain is now on pattern training really yeah let's resign this one for 1100 excellent okay let's move on to the next game so that's the first win loss sorry let's treat that you know we're treating it as the tournament thing we are expecting to play stronger players strong players um so yep okay let's say that we just got our asses handed to us on that one so let's go for a new one our target is one win or two draws for the big style oh checkmate <laughs> um so that's the second tough game so really now we have to we have to get a one win out of the next two games as part of the tournament okay so it's been real let's go oh dear gm okay let's resign this one so we have to win the next one last one this is my final wow Computer, look at the speed, just bump, 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 bump. It's like automated. <laughs>
He's taking the queen. Damn. <laughs> it's a missed opportunity. Two rooks versus a queen. Do you think that's going to wash? Thought they were preparing that to take the rook and then have two rooks against the queen. bit of a risk because it can still turn out to be a draw or they can whoop me with the two rooks just because I've got a queen if they do capture don't think there's a defense so we'd be taking the rook so I think they're going to take and it's going to be a queen against two rooks Really going to town on it, but yeah, there we go. Don't think there's much we can do. We can attack a pawn. We put a check on the king, attack the rook, but he attacks the pawn. As we said, we take, he takes, we take, he takes.
I try and take here. No point doing this, but we'll try anyway. It just brings this. Oh, it's because they're going a bit speedy. Didn't think that was going to work, and they've resigned. So we reached the target. We actually won one of the games. And that's realistic in terms of what my prediction is for the tournament. Right, so we're going to start another, another four game situation. We won one in the last four series. Let's see if we can bump it up a bit.
We won two. Yay, we've overperformed. So we don't need to play any of the other games. We can go home now from the tournament and we're happy as Larry. If that happened in the over the board game, I would be so happy in the over the board tournament in two weeks time. Um, yeah, I'd be so happy. I probably won't go back and play the rest of the games. No, I would, but I'd have that mindset of I really don't care about the next games. Excellent. All right, so we're jumping in onto the next one. And again, we're not even taking the long breaks here, actually. We're kind of just flying through these games. Um, but because we normally just take a bit of a break and come back a little bit fresher. I'm just jumping in and see what we can do. So we've over overperformed in this um, current series, four game series. But I don't want to fall back. Let's see if we can still keep the momentum going as best possible. Surprised at that. I'll take with the rook. Yeah. <laughs> Uh. 
Oh my word, how lucky are we getting? It should have been recording still on. <laughs> there we go. Um, okay.
to draw. We've overperformed anyway, so we've won three games in a row. So I, I can afford to lose a game if they don't think that it's a draw. Gonna try and get his knight in here, isn't it? Attack this pawn. Yeah, just as we were saying, he's trying to fashion get into here. So how does he do it? Uh, it'll get taken here. And get taken here to come in so the, the access into this square oh apart from this one there that's the one so he needs to get his knight there we can defend we might as well just put the knight here and just defend is there another pawn he can attack this one it's got no support so how would he need to get that Because if he gets in here, then he can dance around, around the back. Around the back. There, so that's the spot where he then can get this pawn. Ooh, okay, so if he gets there, then how can I can't defend that pawn, can I? Okay, that's what they're going for. Yeah, they've got it planned. Got it planned out. Yeah, they're coming for it. Yeah, it's like a... Take it off the board with the bishop. Take it off the board with the bishop. Can we get this pawn? We need to be here. How do we get there? And here. Bishop fast enough. Mm, can't actually squeeze in. <clears throat> can't actually squeeze their bishop in. Is this another miracle? This is surreal. I don't think we'll make it though. It's going to block the pawns off. Still fast enough, isn't he? Because <clears throat> if we push, then he just comes behind. The only piece that, well, the bishop can move, yeah. And if we push, he just goes behind. Yeah, that's a shame. So here, I'm going to lose on time. They're going to make me lose on time. They don't want to go for a draw, they, they, they think there's an end somewhere. And it's just Bishop, yeah, so he's like doing different moves to not make it a draw.
because the computer is not going to f wait well i offered the draw first time excellent so that was a really good four game challenge we actually won three games and we got a draw